Hello, everyone. It's Rob Collier reporting in. Um, happy spring to you all. It's the end of March, and we know spring is coming to our fabulous Michigan, and we should have a great fruit crop this year, thanks to this cold weather we've all been having. On the screen of our website um, today, you'll see this wonderful picture of our great state. I always love looking at the map of Michigan. And you'll see that this spring, CMF is doing something new. We're going on the road. We're going to be having regional meetings as far north as Harbor Springs. And we really encourage you to join us for one of these regional meetings. They're all taking place in the first week of May. And what a better way to start off your May than joining CMF and your peers. One of the reasons why we're doing this is because we hear from our members that they like getting together and hearing from each other. So part of this is going to, these regional meetings will be a wonderful networking opportunity. Um, we're going to have peer learning circles. But we're also going to be doing two other very important things. One of our new partners, actually not new partner, but a partner that we've been working with for a number of years, is GEO, Grant Makers for Effective Organizations, coming from Washington. And this is a great organization, a great resource for grant makers in Michigan. And we're bringing them to us, to Michigan for the week, to focus on pathways to grow impact. Because we know that impact is a critical part of, our, of effective grant making and is one of the goals that all of our members have. So the staff, the resource people from GEO will be joining us for the week. It'll be an important part of our regional meeting agenda. The other reason why it's going to be so important to get together is to talk about what's going on both in Lansing and Washington. Um, we just returned from a very successful Foundations on the Hill. We had 28 members joining us for that. And it was really exciting to see the positive response we got from our members of Congress. But we also know that important discussions are going on in Washington about the future of the charitable tax deduction. And we're very fortunate to have Dave Camp, Representative Camp, and Representative Levin as the ranking members of our um, you know, the chairman and ranking minority member of the House Ways and Means Committee. So we'll be giving you a Washington update as well as a Lansing update because in early May we'll have a good sense as to how the state budget looks and what it means for all of the public-private partnerships that you're involved in um, throughout our state. The other added dimension in our discussions about policy and our discussions about both Lansing and Washington is this new vocabulary world called sequestration and what it means for our public-private partnerships. So I encourage you to join us um, in, in these regional meetings. If you can't get to the one in your area, come to explore a new part of Michigan and join us. We're starting on May the 6th in Auburn Hills, going to Lansing on May the 7th, St. Joseph on May the 8th, Harbor Springs on May the 9th, and ending up in Grand Rapids on May the 10th. It's a great opportunity to meet your fellow grant makers from around the state, as well as to hear from both GEO and get updates on what we're all about in both Washington and Lansing on our policy work. So once again, have a happy spring from all of us at CMF, um, and we look forward to having you join us in May. Many thanks.